Hello, I'm Todd Cotta. This is Anthony. Today we talk about the brand new California released 5 inch 9 millimeter Kimber Rapide competition gun right here on Reviews It. You know, it's been a very long time since we've had a new Kimber in California. Yeah. And we've been running Kimbers for quite a long time, and we're a master dealer here for Kimber. But uh, they did it. They figured out a way to get a gun to California with a magazine disconnect and the loaded chamber indicator. That's pretty neat. It's the brand new. It's, and, and they brought it out almost simultaneously with their 50 state gun. Yeah. Their 48 state gun or whatever it is. Immediately when they announced it, it came out not, yeah. not too long after. Yeah. And then we've been waiting and waiting and waiting and waiting for this thing. We've had a lot of customers asking. This one's actually sold already. Yeah. And he gave us permission to shoot this video. Yep. You're going to be spending $1,900 on this baby right here. But uh, let's talk about why this gun is different than other Kimber 9mm pistols. Yeah, so, so the first thing we're going to start with that's a little bit different than your most common uh, 1911 Kimbers is going to be the lightning cuts and the front sides that you see right here. Top and sides yeah. of the barrel. And what I really like about the rear sides is they're very deep in there. So if you want to press check or if you want to just rack it easily, you got a very good grip on it to get a good wrap. And if you want to press check it as well, it's a lot easier um, than said something that's a little bit more smoother. But they have serrations in the front too. Oh, they do. See? Yeah. So if you take a look right here. You right got there, serrations yeah. front and back. And they're both as cut, deep as cut as well. You got the satin cut on the top of the barrel so there's no glare coming between the, the sights. And you got holes top and sides here to lighten the front up. This gun is a purpose-built race gun or... You know, I was watching Coleon Noir's video of this gun. His Ooh. first complaint was, why isn't this a 2011? That is, yeah, one of the things that I would say as well. Um, you you get, make this a double stack, and you just up the value of it just so much more. The problem with a double stack, though, is you have a whole handful of gun. They get to be almost too big for many yeah. people to shoot. So there might be a Rapide 2011 in the works, that having be. both options for bigger hands or smaller hands. I don't know. I, 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 I don't know. I wouldn't put it past them to do that, though. That would be awesome. This one has the gold barrel. This one has uh, the night sights, but you can also get the Rapide in the high sights for co-witnessing with optics. You don't have the optic cuts for California, but you do have them for other states. Yeah. This one here, the grips. Tell me about those grips. <laughs> so one thing about these grips that I, if you're a fan of G10 grips, you're already off the bat, you're gonna love these. What's a little bit different about these G10 grips is these actually have a pattern grip. They actually have little cuts inside for your fingers. So when you grip it, it's a little bit more of a grab onto your hand type of texture. They sink into the grip. And it just feels amazing immediately when you grab it, when you touch it. It's just a nice feel in the hand and they really, really did a fantastic job with the cuts on these G10 grips. So with the new, Model Rapide, and we got to talk about that. Some people call it the Rapide, but think about it. The the word, and I called it that for a while. Yeah, yeah, we both did. <laughs> but it's a word from the French. The French, when they talk about fast, the French word for fast is Rapide. <laughs> rapide. Rapide, there okay? <laughs> so it's very uh, rapid car, you know, uh, auto. Uh, so they're using a French word for rapid, and there was a Austin Martin Rapide and some other ones. So, mm -hmm. so basically, the name is rapid. Rapide in French is well, and in English is is fast yeah. or rapid. So this is supposed to be a competition gun, and it's it's <laughs> comes in many different iterations. They're all cut slides, mm -hmm. but you can get them in different colors, different grips, different. So you have the ice, which is silver with blue trigger and blue grip. Ooh. So you have a blue trigger and blue panel, grip panels. Mm -hmm. Then you have the heat, which is all black, but it has a, a, a red, <laughs> <laughs> it has red grips on it. It's all black with red grips. Okay. The frost is silver with a black barrel and black trigger. And then the dusk, black with bronze barrel and black trigger. Okay, they went all out with the colorway. Dawn, this one here awesome. has the gold barrel with black trigger, and it has the gray G10 uh, grips. Scorpius is like the Eclipse, the black chrome. Mm -hmm. That's the Scorpius that is that one. Oh, wow. 
So it has that same finish. So as they have the, about what, like six models, six different type of colors? Oh, seven or eight. <laughs> and then the Rapid Standard is black and gold with gray grip. So it's all black, mm -hmm. gold barrel with, with uh, gray grips. That is neat. So they have seven or eight different versions of this gun in different colors, different styles for people that have different preferences. Yeah. And that's pretty cool. That's that they awesome. Would, that they would yeah. come out with so many versions of this gun. And, and... So you have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven different versions mm -hmm. times three. Times three. Nine millimeter, 45, 45. 10. Wow. 10 see, you learn everything, something new every day. That is sweet. <laughs> you, you, already leading with the seven colorways, I thought, wow, that's, that's fan service at its finest. Yeah. But to give them 45 for the true, true 1911 lovers and then the 10 millimeter for the new bear killer ammo, that <laughs> is pretty awesome man when you and then going back to the competition one thing about this uh 1911 that i really like it comes with a 12 pound recoil spring now most people know um you're gonna come with a natural about 14 around there is your most common coming with the stock 12 and then with the trigger being at four to five and it has that nice v curve trigger a lot of them sometimes they'll be flat this one is actually skele uh, skeletonized and yeah. it's a v curved and it's at a four and a five pound uh pool that is for, like you said, for competition, for racing, that is actually a very, very nice trigger to shoot with. Good. Well, you know what's going to make the biggest difference for us is taking this thing out on the range oh, and yeah. doing some pew pew time and yeah. seeing how we are at seven yards that with a gun fantastic. like this. Because <laughs> if we shoot bad with a gun like this, we need to back up and we learn got all a over again. <laughs> Let's head into the range. Awesome. Rapid, nine millimeter competition gun from. Kimber, I can automatically feel the, 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 the 10 grips on these things with your fingers falling in the holes right here. <laughs> yeah, it's kind of like the Glock gimmicky thing because your fingers, no fingers will fit this perfectly because everybody's got different kinds of hands. Exactly. But let's see how accurate a race gun is in 9mm from Kimber. Already feels wonderful and I love 1911s. Come on, what's going on? Last one. Having nine rounds kind of sucks for a race gun or a competition gun. But if this came out in a 2011 with 17 rounds, that's a completely different thing, isn't it? Oh, definitely. Pretty happy. You're gonna shoot now, and I'm gonna hold that, and then we'll go check our targets at the end. Let's go. My turn now. Nine rounds of nine millimeter at the Kimber Rapid. Let's go. Oh my God. <laughs> so, all clear. What's the? That is an amazing feel. First shot. Oh, I already felt it. I've shot 1911s before. Yeah. That was an amazing feel. All clear. Okay. This was my nine rounds right here at seven yards. You shot touch faster. A little bit faster, and there's yeah. your nine rounds. But for shooting yards. a little bit faster, it's, it, I didn't feel the muzzle flip at all on me. No, that, no, 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 an amazing no. shooting gun. Oh, you know, sometimes it's a double-edged sword when you lighten the nose of a 1911 because that takes weight off of it, which will increase the, the felt flip. recoil yeah. because there's less weight up at the nose. But, yep, pretty happy. Pretty happy with it, and uh, I hope that, uh, yeah, I hope my customer that bought this oh, he's gonna love it, it because <laughs> there is no reason why not to love this gun. Let's go finish up back in the store. Let's go. There really is no comparison between a striker fire and a 1911 when it comes to precision shooting. Oh, no, not at all. And that's why 
you know, Terran Tactical has the Pit Vipers and all those guns because mm -hmm. they're all 1911 based. Yeah, Staccatos, all that. Staccato. Um, now the new Prodigy from uh, Springfield. Exactly, the 2011 on that one there. Mm -hmm. So just know that, yeah, they're expensive, but you get what you pay for. Oh, definitely. And Kimber has done one heck of a job with this gun. What do you think? I have no, the only complaint I have of it, of course, is the, the ma uh, magazine capacity. Yep. That's it. Okay. But that's a 1911, so that should be enough said. It felt amazing in the hand immediately when I grabbed it. Like Todd said himself, it just it, it sticks to your hand. Um, the first shot, I definitely noticed. You drilled it. You drilled it. Yeah, on the it, very it, first it, shot. it is amazing. An it is an insane feeling gun. It is not nothing that's going to jump on you. You know, when most people see 1911s, they see a big heavy gun <clears throat> and they think, you know, recoil, big. You know, um, that thing was amazing. You know what I like about 1911s most of all? What you like? Do you even think about the trigger? No, 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 that, that thing's amazing. You, it's just, you don't even think about no. the trigger because it's not a factor in the shooting. It really isn't. And call me crazy, but I believe that's an adjustable trigger as well. So if four and a five pounds is in smaller, see that hole right there? You should be able to stick a pin right there. And, and, and oh yeah, it does. It has a little car. Uh, so a if, little if four to five wrench. pounds isn't enough for you, you can chop that baby down a little bit more and make your gun even more better. Yep. There you go. More better. More better. For Anthony, I'm Todd Cotta. Please subscribe below because... You want to watch more of these, I know you do. Definitely. And thank you for watching Reviews It.